and welcome back to Square Mechanics Survival Let's go to Today what we're going to be doing is cracking on with our lovely farm. I've also done a, a, a wee bit of adjustments here, which I'll show you guys in a memento. But yeah, if you do want to enjoy today's episode, please smash like. So yeah, today what we're going to be doing is working on the farm. I have moved... The stairs, the stairs are gone. I got quite a few comments. One was really good in particular, and it said, Squid, why don't you have uh, some of the ramps, like, pull up? And then I thought, well, why don't we just do a lift? So when the bad guys come at night, they have no way of getting up to me. So what I've done so far is I've just kind of put these things here. Uh, because we're going to do a few tester runs on the first night. So what I want to do is do some more stealing. As you can see, I've built Bert Mac 2. It's nothing like the old Bert. He's not blue or red. I don't I don't feel right painted in blue or red. Bert's not even there. He doesn't even have the, the rubber ducky Bert. So I ain't even made one. Uh, it's going uh, to take me a while to come around to actually making one, guys. But we've made another flyer, which is absolutely amazing. I spent like two to three hours grinding the component kits yesterday um, to try and get this done for today's episode. So we managed to do that. So that's awesome. So yeah, the plan is we are going to go and plant a few crops here. We're going to put these ramps all the way around the outside and see how they kind of cope. Uh, and then what I want to do is under here, I kind of want to make some traps. So I'm either going to make a saw blade trap or I kind of want to make some pistons. Basically, when they come near, the pistons kind of come down and sandwich them and squish them. Which I thought would be pretty funny, but I want to see how powerful these ramps are. So, let me give you guys a tour. Uh, this is my underneath. I've put some lights here. Look at these lights. They look absolutely fabulous. So we can see what we're doing uh, at night. Also, I've made myself a little elevator. Whee! <laughs> Which I think is pretty awesome. You can get to it. So if it's, if it's stuck up there and you can't get up, I've put another button here. i put a logic gate underneath. So we can get up and get down. And then also we've got the front door just because I really like a front door. So that is what we've been doing. Nothing too hectic. So I thought what we'd do for the start of today's episode is do a bit of looting. I still need to work on my house and I still need to try and get myself some more of these bits, some more metal blocks. I've organized my chest a little bit. Um, but yeah, we're going to go and do some more stealing, which I love doing. <laughs> and then we're going to work on the farm and all the traps. So hopefully as well, by today's episode, we'll have ourselves a spud shotgun. Uh, we have the broccoli seeds now, so we're going to go and grow them. And uh, we need to go see Larry, actually. Let's go see Larry and see how much the, uh, the spud shotgun is. Also, you may notice that I've put it on a button. Yay! No more flying away vehicles today. Anyway, let's go. Let's go see my jolly good old friend, Mr. Larry. And see how he's doing. Beautiful landing there. Beautiful landing. Larry! Larry, look look at that. What do you think of that? Eh, it's good, that, isn't it? It's brilliant. Here, do you want a closer look? Because I know you obviously can't come outside. You, you're chained up or something. I don't know. Look. Look at that beast. That's the Burt Mac 2. He's like, man, I wish I had one of them. <laughs> I wish I was allowed outside. <laughs> oh, Larry, mate, it's fine. Are you chained up in there, or have you... What's up with you? Are there vegetables trying to pull you back? Anyway. Oops, I think I broke the game. Oh. <laughs> we see ya. Well, what's happening? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> so, if you go to Larry with the hood off, you can just run away. <laughs> no, don't leave me. Oh, my God, that's so weird. That is so weird. That's broken, so don't do that, guys. That's kind of glitched. Anyway, let's see what we can actually... Uh, let's see what the shotgun needs. So we need broccoli. That's pretty much all we need. So, all right, cool. Well, see you later, Larry. Have fun doing nothing all day. I'm going to go fly. I bet he's well jealous. Bye. <laughs> Holy crap, this thing's fast. Um, okay, so we need to do some looting. So we need to reposition our vehicle. I think we bashed it. Oh, no. <laughs> That's, I love the ragdoll physics. This is so stupid. Okay, so did we steal everything from the, over there, that warehouse? I think we did. We might have to go a little bit further. How much fuel do we have in the old girl? Five and six, and I've got 20 in here. So let's just go exploring, I reckon. Let's just go and do some exploring and see if we can find ourselves uh, another warehouse. I just got to kind of remember which way I've gone. Kind of need to do some balancing stuff with Burt Mac 2. 
Because it seems like it's worse. I don't think this fuel is going to last much longer. <laughs> this is pretty cool, though. I haven't seen another warehouse yet. I know there's one over there. Whee! <laughs> Any warehouse yet? We've kind of, like, corrected ourselves. That's pretty sick. Is that the previous warehouse? I feel like it is, but we could go and investigate. Oh, no, I've run out of fuel! No! Uh-oh. Bert's in a sand pit. Okay, so we need to kind of, you know, not waste as much fuel. So we'll do 10 on each. And we'll do 10 for you. Uh, and then we kind of need to just... Be gentle with the fuel consumption here. Ah, the lag. The lag is real. So this is the one we've been to before. However, it does have more of these little scrap blocks, which is pretty decent, actually. But we don't really want them. We want these bad boys. We want these wraps. <gasps> but it is a new one. Wait, what the hell? I thought... I thought... Wait, how? We didn't even go that far. Oh, well, no complaint. This is actually what we need, so I'm glad we came here. All right, this steals all the metal. You, know, you guys know the drill. You guys, This isn't your first rodeo. Steal all the metal, and then we steal our beautiful little circular pieces. Oh, God. <laughs> ah! Yes. All the pieces in the world. They're all mine. Okay. All right. Well, we've done pretty well, actually. Let's see you the tomato. And uh, let's steal some of this metal. Might as well steal some concrete as well while we're here. We might as well just steal everything while we're here. Who am I kidding? I'm just steal everything. So, once we get back home, we need to do, like, one more trip to get the ramps. Because we need to, like, put ramps all the way around. And, uh, and then we should be fine. And with all this metal that I've just stolen, we should be able to make some saw blades. And, like, any traps we want, pretty much. We've just literally just, you know, stolen enough to get by. So I'm pretty happy about this. I can't believe this is a new one. It kind of feels like it's the same one, but it's, you know, it's obviously not. There's more metal here as well. <gasps> okay, come on. Just go down. That's it. It's going. It's going. It's going. It's not going. I'll help it. We'll give it a gentle tap. Oh, God, it's getting nighttime. Oh, we need to quick. My sense of direction is pretty bad in the daytime, let alone nighttime. Oh, really? You're going to land up there? <laughs> really? Come on. Go faster. Come on, Timber! Yeah, yo! Mine! Thanks for doing business, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, all right. Kind of like them satellites as well. I might steal them. Okay. Bert, two. Where are you, buddy? We need to get the, the heck out of here. Oh, I don't know where home is. Wish me luck. <laughs> Whoa! Look at all these islands! I bet Bert's around here somewhere on holiday. Having the time of his life. Look at that square that's not even rendered in. That's beautiful. Oh, there's the maze I went to. So how, our house is just over here, this way. Why does this vehicle go sideways for no reason? Okay, we're just over this hill. <laughs> Bert 2 is now sideways. I'm still controlling it somehow, though. Still gonna park it majestically. Ready for this, guys? Ready, ready, ready. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. Like a boss. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at them parking skills. <laughs> All right. How much fuel do we use in that journey? Four. Let's use six. Okay, not too much. All right, let's build these towers even higher. Okay, so we'll remove all of this. Pop all this in here. So we get maximum amount of things in our hot bar. Jolly good. Okay, so I don't really know how much higher we need to go, but let's just... Let's just crank it. All right, good morning, guys. Another new day in Scrap Mechanic. And look what we've got. Uh, we've extended the towers right up, and they are looking absolutely fabulous right now. They're looking so good. I've done these on both sides. Uh, we don't have any for the back yet because I kind of ran out. But they're looking really good. So I thought what we'd do is take a break from the uh, base building, and uh, we'll start working on the farm. And then we'll quickly go back, get the rest of these ramps, put them all the way around, uh, and then we'll see how this uh, how this does for the first proper raid. Now, there's going to be no traps for the first sort of uh, wave. I just purely want to see what it's going to be like. Uh, and then the second night, we'll start implementing some traps. I've got a few ideas. As I say, I kind of want um, some stuff to kind of squash them and stuff like that. We might even fit some water cannons uh, facing down. Or we might do the good old, like, spinny thing. You know, where you kind of put a bearing and a piece of wood and then a thruster and then just let it spin. 
Uh, but I feel like the crushing is actually gonna hurt them quite a lot. I feel like if you just throw them, then... Throwing them just kind of like puts them in like a ragdoll state, but they kind of come back. But if you actually crush them, I feel like they just get killed. So I kind of wanted to make like a mob farm. I don't know if it would be possible to do it, but... The idea is they, they all come from both sides and then in here is where we have some sort of trap and then in the morning we can obviously uh, put us we can just pick all this up so uh, yeah let's get to work anyway like scrap mechanic waits for no one the time goes super super quick uh, let's turn these lights off because it's uh, we don't need it it's daytime and let's go get ourselves some soil now I have gathered quite a few bits of soil I haven't got any soil from my old farm which I still need to get um, so we should have some. Here we go. We got loads. We got absolutely loads. We've got plenty of soil. So this should do for the first farm. Uh, I'm kind of thinking how I want to base it because I kind of want it to be like symmetrical. So, 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 so. What is my center point? <laughs> so we've kind of worked out that this door is sort of the center point. Apart from this. This needs to come out one more, doesn't it? <gasps> it is not symmetrical. Now that would be symmetrical, and that is the center point. So, let's work off these walls here. I kind of need some blocks. Okay, let me get some blocks, and then we're going to actually sort of do this properly. Okay, so, <laughs> look at the state of this. So, these are, this is my symmetrical, can we fit three soil in here, please? So, this is like a, a three by three. One. Two. No! <laughs> it's not gonna be symmetrical. My OCDs! Ah. Now, this ain't right. This ain't right, guys. This ain't right. This is right, but it ain't right. <laughs> this probably isn't bothering anyone else, but it's bothering me. Do you know what? It'll look fine. As long as it's all in line, it'll look fine. I've done my best to get the center point, and that's all I can really ask for. We're not gonna make it perfect. I'd have to move the whole base, so... You know what? This is the start of our farm. So let's begin planting. I should really start thinking about like a an automatic like watering system as well. Uh, I know like all the other sc scrappy YouTubers has that. So I should really um, yeah eat carrots and think about that because we got the the lake right there. It wouldn't be too hard to do. But that's not today. Today's about traps and stuff. So and it's already like four o'clock. What the crap? How have I spent all this time? Measuring out soil. <laughs> I suppose while we've got all these sort of markers in place, I should sort of map out uh, where I want the edge of the farm to come to because we kind of need to save some area for the trap. So I'm going to mark out like an edge uh, of our farming area. Uh, and then at least we know where we, we can go to. Okay, so that's the farming area marked out. It's quite a big area, to be honest. It's going to be more than enough, uh, you know, for what we actually need. So... I think we just have enough, enough time to go back, get ourselves, um, yeah, get ourselves the rest of the ramps, and let's try and get this set up, uh, and just see how the ramps sort of cope with, uh, as like a first line of defense. Actually, you know what, I've, uh, I've nearly run out of fuel, so it might be not a bad idea to actually start with the traps. So let me do a little bit of work here, and uh, we'll get all this filled in, and then, We'll go over some traps together. Now, what I'm going to try, first of all, the first trap is going to be the piston trap. So, I'm going to need quite a few pistons. Let's just see how expensive they are. We might need to upgrade them as well. So, we'll quickly have a look at them. So, the pistons are going to be... Um, okay, type 2 metal, 2 oil. Not really bad with the components. What about a saw blade? 10 of them and 10. So, we could try the saw blade. The only problem with the saw blade is you need gas for them. So, mm. we could try the water cannon. The water cannon could be pretty cool. The only problem with the water cannon is it doesn't destroy, and we want it stuff to destroy. Uh, yeah, not to just, you know, wet and <laughs> moisten up. But yeah, I think what we'll try first is let's try the saw blade. So, I'm going to make a few saw blades, and uh, we're probably going to have to do it tomorrow night now. But what I'll do is I'll skip ahead. I'll quickly finish off underneath, uh, and then I'll meet you guys down there for our little saw blade trap and see how it goes. All right, guys, welcome back to another new day. We've been doing a little bit more bits and bats. Let me show you what we got going on here. So we are building right now our saw trap. We have just about enough materials. I say just about because we are running low on a lot of things. 
But, uh, yeah, we're doing all right. We're not doing too bad. I'm just trying to work out the design of these things here. I think I'm going to use these metal pipes because they look a little bit cooler. So we're going to use these. I um, don't know if I've, like, I don't know if I've left too much gap. That's my only worry at the minute. I feel like they're going to be able to get in here. I don't know if this is going to be the right height. I don't know if, they, uh, maybe we should do it, like, lower down, do you think? Maybe? I don't really know. I feel like the tape bots aren't really going to get hit by these. So we might have to go a little bit lower down. Might just put them on these girders. Like, are these girders? I bet these girders are like the same height. But I don't they're even taller, actually. Yeah, no, maybe that's not a good idea. We'll put them in between there for now. There we go. They they're going to get to good use. They'll, they'll block some stuff up. Oh, I knew I had more fuel. I didn't know it was there. Ah. So tonight we're going to test this out. It's going to be pretty interesting. I think I have... Basically, I think I've covered all my sort of gaps and stuff like that. All this bottom floor isn't symmetrical, but to be honest, I, I just don't have the materials. I thought I had enough materials, uh, but I don't. We've got enough materials for all the saws and stuff, but I'm not sure if these are going to be too tall. <laughs> Ow, it does hurt me, though. <laughs> um, should we just see? What we're going to do is just plant a few tomatoes, so it's not really going to cause much bother. Uh, if we get it too wrong, so like even if they do come in and destroy everything, they're only gonna destroy uh, a few tomatoes. And it's, it's we're basically doing it as a test tonight. This is the first trap, so it is gonna be a tester run. So what I need to do is collect my last two saws. I'm gonna put a few more of these little blocks on here, and uh, and then we should be good to go. But yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. The only thing I'm worried about is the uh, fuel consumption. The fuel consumption is going to be pretty nuts, but yeah, look at all these saws. It's a little bit overkill, I know, but it's going to be funny. Also, do I have to connect all these together? Like, if I put an engine down on the ground, like behind here, will I... How many can I connect to one of these? Oh, we can't. Because it's not... It has to be connected to the roof. Oh, no. Because if it's connected to the roof, then this is connected here, then it'll register it as a part of the same build. So, yeah. Okay. We'll have to make this bigger then. Okay, so how many of these can we have on one engine, I reckon? That's going to be interesting. Or annoying. <laughs> one or the other. Okay, that's not central. I don't think we have a central point for these, but I'm hoping the bots will run into it. Again, this is a trial run. So, I know it doesn't look perfect right now, but I just wanted to do the first sort of trap. Can you imagine if, like, the bots just literally walk past this thing? They're like, eh, whatever. We'll just, we'll just stroll past and kill all the tomatoes. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. Thanks for making an effort, though. Like, I would cry. That's all the saws set up. That's a lot of S's. Um, how, how many can we connect to? This is a level five engine. So, if I can get all... Get away with all of these connected, then I will be so happy. One more. That's all you need to do. One more connection. Woo! We did it! Oh, yeah! Okay. It's five o'clock. Crap. We need tomatoes. Oh, no. Spuds. Spuds. Whatever we have the most of. Let's go and see whatever we have the most of. Uh, carrots. Okay, it's gonna be, it's gonna be carrots. Do we have buckets? Because I'm probably gonna have to do this old-fashioned way for the first night. Yes, we have buckets for days. I do have my water pump, but I really can't be bothered getting that set up. And it's going to take a while to get it, like, automated and stuff like that. And I haven't really thought about that yet. But we got enough buckets, so uh, let's not worry about it. Okay, let's water all these, guys. And then we got five minutes. So I will see you. Actually, let's put the lights on. I'll see you just before these whippersnappers come. Then we can put the engines on and, uh, yeah, see if the traps work or not. Okay, here we go. It is time. Let's turn the engines on. Let's see what happens. Oh, these guys are too small, I reckon. Oh, they don't want to go into it. Oh. Hey, how did he get? How did he get in? How did he get through? He wrecked a carrot. They're going for my mail. Well, that's annoying. How much fuel is this thing taking? We're really, really still on one, okay. Oh, he got wrecked! Hey, what the hell? How did he get in? No way. Oh, they wrecked some of the carrots. Well, that sucks. Okay, there's another wave here. Okay, they wrecked... This guy's wrecking this. Oh! Oh! 
Okay. So he's definitely stopping them. Okay, they can get through there, though. That's interesting. The rest of these guys just don't want to come in. So he's definitely, he's definitely stopping them. Apart from you, who just, like, strolls through. What? Oh. <laughs> How much fuel are we going through? Still one. Wow. They're really effective on, a, like, a really low, low range. Come on. Come on, Whipbot. Come and get me. Interesting. So it is a bit of a deterrent. I feel like it might be... It might make more sense for me to actually have uh, a couple of these walls, like, blocked off. And then maybe have some of these guys going around uh, on, like, pistons and stuff going back and forth. <laughs> oh, my God. This guy's getting wrecked. Does it really seem like it's that effective at killing? Like, it's not like a one sort of spin kill. It's kind of fuel efficient, though. I'm not going to lie. We've had it on for, like, an hour now, and it's still not really gone down much. So, that is trap one. So... I'd give it a, I don't know, I'd give it a 4, 5 out of 10. Not that good. We can do better. So let's try, uh, let's try my second option, which is I'm going to put some, I'm going to kind of block all these walls up and then I'm going to have maybe two of them open. I'm going to have some ramps that lead up and then I'm going to have them dropping into a load of these things. Because it feels like if I can get them in, then they're just going to get annihilated. But it's actually getting them into the traps. Because look... Look, he's not even killing him. What? Okay, this guy's invincible. I can't hit him. I can't hit him. He's invincible. No, what? He's invincible. What? No, my crops, dude. How, why is he not dying? Why is he not dying? What the crap? This guy's a boss. Hey! Die! Die! Come on! I'm grinding his head. Hey! No! What? Okay, what do I put it on higher? Okay, that guy is an absolute beast, and he just did not die. Right, so I've blocked up the two main entrances. The second trap is we are going to basically put ramps all the way along. Kind of want them a little bit higher than that, so we might have to... I don't know how steep they can climb up stuff. Actually, let's make this a little bit more concentrated. I've got, a, I've got an idea. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Kind of like that, but a little bit further back. Okay, okay, so maybe like this and then we need this and then we need that and then we need to go like that push it along and then just go like that and then the traps are gonna be there cool so this is the plan this is the idea it's probably not gonna be symmetrical but we haven't really got time to make it all nice and pretty as of yet so we're just gonna get it all going i know my carrots have grown but we're still using them as a tester i don't really want them i probably need them judging by my thirst but, uh, yeah, they're just going to be as a tester for now. Let's do this, uh... I've got enough for four wide each. Okay, i got four minutes, four minutes, four minutes, four minutes, four minutes. Come on, squid. Is this going to be enough? Did a little Yep, yeah, nice. <laughs> um... Oh, am I going to have enough ramps? Oh, please, I've got enough ramps. Please, 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 please. I hope I've got some more on that side. I haven't really looked, so... I'm just going to kind of go with it. Okay, let's look. Do we have any more ramps? Okay, I don't think this is the same as the other side, but again, I'm not going for symmetry. We are literally just going for destruction. So let's see if we can get this this thing working. I need some more of these sticky things. That's my friends list. That's not going to help me. Uh, we can kind of move this one over a little bit, I reckon. Oh my goodness, this is this is proper like last minute stuff, isn't it? All right, the the trap is set. I hope they actually come in and they don't just go for my walls. If they go for my walls, then they are lame. Oh, we got seconds. Oh, crap. 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 Quick, quick. Uh, link it to there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Link it to there. Yeah. Uh, link you to there. Uh, eat a carrot. Okay, please come for me. 
Let's go, let's see if this works. If this doesn't work, then they're stinky. They're big stinky faces. Okay, <laughs> here they come. Oh, yeah, the lag's here. We definitely know they're here. No, I can either break in stuff. No, come round. Come round. Come to the traps. No, my... No, you're supposed to come to the traps. No. Why is not walking up the ramps? Oh, man, I've spuds. Is any of them going to come up there? Okay. Here, follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Here, here, look, up here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come up. Come up. Come up. Yes! One's got in. One's got in, he's stuck. Yeah, here, here, go, go, go. Go, go, go. In you come. This? Yes, there we go. Wait, one got through. <laughs> Oh, you're joking me. Now I'm trapped. I must have glitched through. Wow, that is so annoying. Huh. Why are you not taking any damage? This guy is unbelievable. This blade spinning in his face, but he's like, you know, I'm just going to keep walking. What is this game? Why? Why? I don't... He should be dead. I can't even fit through there without getting hurt. Something's, something's wrong here. <laughs> this guy should be dead. You should be dead, sucker. This guy's smashing his way in. And this guy's just walking into my blade without any repercussions. I don't think the traps are that good in this game. I don't know. Maybe we, we need the blades to, like, constantly move. But he should be dead, man. He should be so dead. Okay, it's all right, mate. You can keep smashing it if you want. I just stole it from a warehouse. Maybe I just need ramps all the way around. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like that's as best we're going to get for the traps. That is six saw blades. We tried them before and they just walked through them. I feel like they need to be all like this for them to work. Do you know what I mean? And how many, like, traps are you going to actually need? Okay, we'll stop it for this guy, see what happens. Is he just stuck? I think he's just stuck. Are you good, bro? Well, I don't know about that one, Chief. I feel like, uh, hmm. The design was good, but it just was not to be. <laughs> There's one thing that I didn't do, and that was the piston traps, but I think they may be too expensive. Hmm. My lift has been wrecked as well. Okay, so we're gonna have two at each side. Um, just to test it, because I'm not gonna have time to do the whole thing today, but we'll do it. We'll, we'll give it a good test. So, how's the limit on this? It's seven. And it's kind of slow. Maybe we can just do it with one. And then we can use, we can actually do it on all four sides if we just have one on each side. So let's see how that goes. So let's bring this out. Kind of like so. We've got ten minutes to do it, so it shouldn't be too much of a, uh, yeah, a bit of a rush job today. So let's go and just do this. So it's seven. And then we got a button on us. No. Okay, we need to get up. I do have um, a decent control. Oh, we got a piston in here as well. Oh, I didn't have to make all them. Oh, well. They'll always come in. Wait, is this... What level is this? This is a level 3 controller. What about this one? This is a level 2. So, we could connect them all up with a controller. Quite slow. That's quite slow going down. That's the fastest as well. So, but we could loop it. So, just kind of do this. Up and then down and then up and then down. But if I remove the controller and then I just kind of see what this does. What's this speed limit? So that's even slower, but it's kind of like a... Ah, I don't really want to upgrade it, but I kind of need to... What level's this one? This one looks like a lot higher level. Level four. Ooh. Okay, so there's no point taking that one down because uh, it's already set up now. So let's work on this side and do the same again. Oh, look at that. <laughs> we gotta go to eight. Oh, that's so much faster. Yes! That's the kind of squishing power we need. Okay, so. That's pretty cool. That's kind of set up now, so we need to do repeat it on... Okay, we'll do it on three sides. I'm kind of gonna board this up, I think. Okay, I'm gonna upgrade these two because they're quite slow. 
And then we will hook them up to one switch. So like this and then like this. So we should kind of go like, actually we, we could do with the switch coming up just so I can see. We need, we need a switch like in the center. So we'll quickly remove this. There we go. So we got a little bit of a, a pushing trap. Who knows if it's going to work or not, guys? Let's just see. It's all about experimenting and uh, seeing if things work. Obviously, we could probably make them faster. We got two more. Let's upgrade this to it so, it look, so it's a little bit faster as well. And all we need now is something to stop them coming in completely. So we got two minutes. I'm kind of going to put a little barrier. I mean, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do all this, and they're literally just going to walk straight in. It'll be something like that. Oh, they'll pick that door instead. <laughs> I guarantee it. Anyway, I'm quite excited about this one. We've done three traps today, so I hope you have enjoyed today's video. It's been, uh, been quite a fun one. I have enjoyed it. You have to do kind of a lot of, a lot of experimenting in this game, so this is why I enjoy it so much. But let's go see if that works now. Let's go and... Uh... Oh. What, what, has, what has happened there? It seems that it's, it's tried to attach itself to the piston and not the ground. Squishy, squishy! <laughs> okay, I kind of want to move um, Bert too. Bert, can you get away from the, the, the people, the, 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 the monsters? There you go. So you, so you get a nice view at night. We don't want you having a crappy view. We want you to see the magic happen as well. Oh, God, they're coming. Here we go. Places, people. Pla There's going to be some looking for the front door. I knew it! Okay, there's one here. There's one here. Here we go. Yes! It worked! Okay, apart from this front gate, we're just going to go to the front gate. Of course you'd come to the front gate, wouldn't you? Oh my goodness, that is so good how that works. <laughs> All right. Why would you smash that? No. That is stupid. What are you doing? I can't believe it worked. Please say there's more. I want more! Bring me more! Alright, so I was going to end the video, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend one more night and see how it goes. I'm going to quickly do some more looting, try and get ourselves a few more component kits, upgrade some of the pistons, and then we'll have one more night and see how the defenses are going. But our base has taken shape so much in the last two episodes, and I'm super excited about this new sort of trap. We've tried the saws. The saws are okay. They're not too bad. Um... <laughs> But yeah, this has been such a fun episode. I've loved playing around with traps. I love doing bits to my base. I, I know I said last episode that I'm not going to spend, like, forever updating my base, but I feel like we should sort of do bits and bats to it. Definitely want to keep making it bigger, but yeah, the traps are a lot of fun. It doesn't really seem like you can make sort of a, a mob farm. I'd love to make, like, a mob farm with the uh, saws, but they seem pretty hard. Maybe we have to have them on sort of, like, a piston. It feels like they're a lot more effective when they're moving on, like, some sort of, like, slider. But, um, yeah, they don't really seem that effective just standing alone. Okay, I'm hoping for a butt ton of component kits, but we'll see what happens. Okay, last building, and then we'll go back and upgrade our pistons and see how this last night pans out for our defenses. Okay, we've uh, managed to get ourselves 15 component kits, which is quite a lot. We should be able to, uh, like, sort of upgrade our pistons, and uh, it should be a jolly good night of killing, or of squashing, shall we say. Okay, we've got a few pistons to upgrade, so let's have a look at this. Uh, yeah, these are quite slow. These to go down to seven. Okay, and let's do the same here. Seven. Let's upgrade. Let's connect these to our switch. Okay, let's see how this is looking. Okay, what's slowest? Okay, these two needs to go down to one more. We'll upgrade them again. And the same for this one. They need to go down one more. We'll upgrade them again. Oh my goodness, this is going to be amazing. Whoop. Squish. <laughs> How have we got five? We can, we can do like a couple more. This one's already on four. This one's on three. We'll do this one as well on four. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Okay, well, that is pretty much it. Let's just go and put ourselves these protector blocks in. And uh, we should be good to go. All right, all of the protective blocks are in. I've done like more for this one. I don't really know why. We could space them out, but it should be fine. They should still want to come for the crops. So, yeah. 
It's time for squishy squishy. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. All right, here we go. Let's begin. Oh, I hope they come. To, I hope they come to these little bits. I hope they don't start smashing me walls to pieces. Maybe if I stand in the middle. Yes. Here we go. Squishy squishy. <laughs> oh, there's one idiot in there. There's always one idiot that has to try and ruin it. Stop. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. Come on, Hairbot. No, come here. I need to test it on Hairbot. Come, come, come this way. Here, 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 here. Here. No, stop smashing stuff up. I mean, you know, you're supposed to smash the foot, but you know what I mean. Come on, we're bots. That's it, that's it, that's it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, why is he not? Wait, what? Did he get flown away? Okay, he's coming back. I want some hair bots. I'm here to try it out on a hair bot. I don't think this whip bot knows what he's doing. No, come here. Hi. Oh my god. <laughs> oh dear. Well, it, I mean, it, it works. It squishes them. Can confirm it squishes them. But I don't know why they still want to come to the walls when we have these squishy devices. Well, guys, that's been my trap episode. I'm st I still want to see if we're going to find ourselves a hairbot. I need a hairbot. I need to test it. Okay, we got ourselves a hairbot. Let's bring it back to the squishy machine. Can we kneel it there? Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Ready? Squish! Yes! <laughs> oh my goodness, that works so well! Wow! Okay. That's crazy. Do you know what? We could have each individual piston connected to a sensor here so when bots like are like here it just squishes them <gasps> that'd be genius instead of us manually manually doing it still don't know where they come through the walls but it is what it is guys anyway that is it for today hope you have enjoyed watching my scrap mechanic episode if you have please smash like and i'll see you tomorrow for another one bye